bunch of bands love to cover this song, and now this band is taking a shot at it. Let's see how this goes, but first... A portion of this episode is sponsored by NordVPN. Take back your online privacy today. Head over to nordvpn.com blp and get our huge discount plus one month for free. And the best part is that it's totally risk-free. So if you don't like it, there's a 30-day money-back guarantee. Do not miss out on this exclusive offer from NordVPN. That's nordvpn.com slash blp. This is Brian. This is Joey P. Antonio here. I'm Kimmy Hart, and we're Reality Sweet, and you're listening and watching The Bottom Line. <laughs> What's going on? Welcome to the bottom line. Jimmy Finizzi with you. I hope you're well. Hit us up on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram at BottomLineWMCX and use hashtag bottom line. Make sure you follow us as well. Helps us a lot. Also, if you are new to this channel, make sure that you subscribe and hit that bell so you do not miss an episode. And please help us reach our goal of 10,000 subscribers. It would mean the absolute world to us. And also be sure you subscribe on all audio platforms that include Jimmy when searching for the bottom line. First and foremost, we want to give a huge thank you to our friends in Reality Suite for providing us with that little video intro right there. Much appreciated. You guys are awesome. Now that that's out of the way, today we have another cover of Separate Ways by Jody to check out. This time, Nemophila is taking a shot at it. Last time we checked out Daughtry's cover of the song featuring Lizzie Hale of Hailstorm, and if you haven't seen it yet, click right up there and watch that first before you watch this. Chris Daughtry himself saw it, so you should watch it too. But the reason why we're checking out this cover is because of a comment I got on the Daughtry reaction video from my main man, Andy Mitchell. He writes, this is an amazing cover. You should check out Nemophila doing the same song. As a matter of fact, they cover a lot of old school metal songs, and there's a video of Asami singing with Lizzie Hale on stage. Well, that's certainly something we'll have to check out at some point, but thank you Andy Mitchell for the comment and for the suggestion. You are the MVP of this video. But with all that being said, if you're hyped up for more Nemophila on the channel, smash that like button, helps out tremendously, and let's jump into this. Let's go! Actually, hold on. Before we get started, I want to tell you about our brand new YouTube channel membership. For those that don't know, we recently launched a YouTube channel membership called the VIP membership. It's $10 a month, and you get priority reaction video requests, a shout out at the end of every single video, your comments will be guaranteed to be replied to in our videos, and a bunch of other awesome perks. So please do us a favor, sign up for our YouTube channel membership. The link is down below in the description section. It would mean the world to us. Become a VIP today and sign up for our YouTube membership. Now enjoy the video. Ooh, already a different key, okay. Ooh. Okay. Already loving the mixing on this. Great in her voice, man. Unreal. Shabby so far. I like it.
The guitar is winning me over in this one. Too shabby, ladies. That was very, very good. I really enjoyed that one. I gotta be honest here. The mixing did kind of throw me off a little bit when it was going into the chorus, but other than that, I can't find anything wrong with this cover. They did a really good job. They kept the same pace as the original song, but they really, really upped the key, and I really do appreciate that from them. But listen, I gotta be honest here. If you're gonna ask me which cover is better, Daughtry's or Nemophila's, I gotta give the slight edge to Daughtry only because A, it's Lizzie freaking Hale, how can you top that? And B, Daughtry's version was heavier, it had a groove to it, they changed the key, and they even improvised on some of the lyrics. So just because of those key factors, I have to give the slight edge to Daughtry's version of Separate Ways. That doesn't mean I don't love this cover, because I really, really do. But, I don't know, if they could have changed the mixing in the chorus a little bit, then I would have said, you know what, this is definitely my favorite one. I have to give the slight edge to Daughtry, but with that being said, I still give this cover a 9 out of 10. I still really, really enjoy this one. I admire how much fun these ladies had filming the video and covering the song, so I do admire that. So I'm not going to be too harsh, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10, and that's the bottom line. What do you think about this? Let me know down below in the comments on YouTube and on all social media at BottomLineWMCX and use hashtag bottom line. If you want more Nemophila content, let me know what I should do next. I'm Jimmy Finizzi, this is The Bottom Line, and I'll see you next time. Peace, and take care.